Call me an idiot. Call me whatever. Call me the N-word. Don't call me no Democrat, man. I'm going to flip. <laughs> Have you guys seen this video going around on the internet right now? This veteran customer or whatever? Well, <laughs> this is ridiculous, man. All over a tackle. So this man here you see on screen, this older white male, I think he's probably a veteran or something. So he bought a taco from Taco Bell, I think. Took it home, probably put the taco in the microwave with the tin foil still on it, the aluminum foil. I'm sure he put it in his micro in his microwave to heat it up and blew up his microwave. <laughs> and he would think for a retired army veteran, he should know you don't put anything aluminum or metal in a microwave. Well, he did. And this microwave blew up. So I came back charging in Taco Bell to confront the employees, the workers over there, for blowing up his microwave. How did that? If you're stupid enough to put tin foil in a microwave, you are going to blow it up. It's not that old. It's not senile. I think it's just stupid. So let's see how this went down. No, you too. I think you should step up. Oh, he's a Republican. <laughs> I love how I love how calling someone a Democrat now is an insult because these Democrats are so loopy right now with the whole far leftist politics. I'm, call me an idiot. Call me whatever. Call me the N word. Don't call me no Democrat, man. I'm a flip. <laughs> Not. You too. I think you should step up. You're, you're a step up. You ran a floor. Now I want you want to hold the food. I want to hold the food. Plus, you guys are going to pay for my microwave. It blew up. Oh, you're smiling. Yo, what the I hope they arrested him, man. I hope they arrested him. This is this is so uncalled for, man. He just slapped the dude, man. Oh man, poor little Mexican dude. They just slapped him over a taco. Buy another taco, and this time don't put the tin foil in the microwave, you loon. Oh, poor fat Mexican. Like, <laughs> like he probably knew he could get away with it. Well, let me go and pick on the little fat Mexican dude, and he's not going to do nothing back. That can't be me, man. <laughs> Reach out from that counter, grab his black jacks of Mortal Kombat. I gotcha. <laughs> Bro, just take just take the L, man. Five people out here just taking L's, man. You just have to hold that one. Just, just hold that L, man. Woo! This is this is rough, man. Five people can't get no break out here. Just like <laughs> it's like a setup to a joke. A white man and a fat Mexican walks into a bar. <laughs> I'm, sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Oh, Jesus. But it's an elderly man, so I understand if you don't want to retaliate because it's a lose-lose situation. You know, you can beat him up and then people will be like, yo, you're beating, beating on an old man. and It's a tricky one. I would, like, I would like to think I would F him up, but then I don't know. I can't beat on an elderly man, man. I have to just take that L. Whew. I might have to just take it. <laughs> I might have to take the L, man. It's them if you do, them if you don't type situation. You have to respect people that work anywhere, especially people that work in fast food restaurants, man. It's like, they're already having a bad... If you think you're having a bad day, right, just know that there's someone having a worse day. Whenever I'm having a bad day and I realize, oh, 
the people working in fast food restaurants, I immediately just start to feel better because no matter how bad your day is, those guys are having it worse. I used to work at KFC when I was younger. Man, Jesus Christ. That was the worst job I've ever had in my life, man. You just want to kill yourself. KFC. Oh, I do not want to think about those days. Whenever I think about those days, I just kneel down, put my hands up, and I start giving thanks to God for delivering me from that. What? I remember I went to, I went to work one day. I just went straight to the bathroom, sat on the toilet, man. Just I just started crying, man. I just started crying. Jeez. It's like it's like a life sucking abyss. Respect these people, man. They're going through a lot, man. Whew. Jeez. You slapped the dude. Man. It blew up. Oh, you're smiling. Yo, what the f? What's going on with you, bro? Hi. The fact that he didn't get beat up, the old man, is that white privilege? <laughs> I want to know. <laughs> I want to know. Is it white privilege or is it old person privilege? Oh, man. The Mexican guy has a lot of patience, man. Is there speaking with the police? Right there beside the person who just slapped him. Maybe he's a gentleman. That couldn't have been me, man. But then again, you never know, man. I can't beat an old guy. I'd like to think I would, but I don't. I, I, oof, I might just have to take that L. <laughs>